Hello, hello, and welcome to At Home with Lucas. So today we're going to be talking about the Windbridge Voice Amplifier, WB800. That's actually what I have strapped to my face right now, and this amplifier right down here is what you're hearing me talk through. So in this video, we're going to be doing a hands-on with the box, then we're going to do a quick unboxing and first impressions on said voice amplifier. After that, I'm going to put this to the At Home with Lucas test and tell you whether this is something you should buy or skip, or maybe it's a good gift or gag gift. One of the two, one of the three, something's going to come. All right, let's go ahead and jump into it. All right, so typically I would just do a very quick unboxing of the actual package and that would be at the very beginning of the video and it would be very quick, but this thing came directly from China. So this is very interesting. It came from Hong Kong, China. Uh, there is the name of the company up the top. Uh. And I just wanted to walk around this this bag because it's been uh, it's traveled a long long distance to get to me right now and that's very cool um, you have a bunch of things on here um, that are stamps you have something <laughs> it's overpack that's hilarious um, you have a bunch of different things that mean something to certain people you have something over here very interesting all right now I guess we'll just crack this bad boy open like I normally would and see what is inside I wonder if this is one of those easy pulls let me see it's gotta be All right, this is like a brick of marijuana. It is uh, about the same size and uh, the same density and it's taped up as if it's trying to not alert the dogs, people. The dogs! All right, let's get into this. Hello! Oh, that is so tightly packed. I actually think they just took random pieces of cardboard and taped them over it. That is hilarious. I guess if you want to save a buck, do it. Man, that's tight. Whew. Yeah, definitely should have gone and choppity chopped all the way around, but nonetheless, we survived. All right, let's take a look at this bad boy right quick. So you got the name of the company right there, the original voice amplifier. This actually looks very similar to a Bluetooth speaker I bought years and years and years ago. All right, for teachers, guides, very cool. All right, this is the M80, <laughs> not the M80, this is the M800. It looks like it's waterproof. Of course, it has a battery in it. Let the world enjoy a more beautiful voice. Cool. All right. I got some. It looks like they actually checked these off. This is hilarious. Take a look at the back right here. Eh. Okay, let's see what we got. Ooh, 400 or 4,400 milliamp hour. That's funny. The 4,400 just came on to Netflix, if you know what that show is. I watched that years ago, and it's actually quite good. Pretty sure they did that because of Manifest. Another good show. Okay, so you got the strap around the neck, around the waist, and then a clip. Very cool. That is hilarious. All right. I'm guessing this is not taped up. Okay. Let's get into the unboxing, people. All right, so you got the user manual right here. Because this is a device that I think I know a lot about, but I don't. I'm going to read all of this for sure. 
there is the amplifier itself. Looks like we got a wall wart. That's the neck strap as we saw in the picture. And is it USB-C? No, it's micro USB. Yuck, gross. All right, so it's got an AUX port. And then here is the, oh, this is hilarious. <laughs> Ah, uh, I'm gonna feel like Britney Spears wearing this thing. That is hilarious. That's gonna wrap around your head. <laughs> that is so funny. Oh, wow. I may use this for the uh, intro of this video. So if you already saw this around my neck, now you know what it's all about. <laughs> Actually, no, I won't use this for the intro. What am I saying? That would be very strange. I don't know if this is bluetooth like to my phone i'm pretty sure it's probably just gonna bluetooth to that all right enough jibba jabba let's get the box out of here <laughs> get the box out of here all right so this right here is made out of like super super cheap um plastic i mean this and if you've ever bought anything from like the dollar store or you got like a bag of goodies that were like had plastic toys in them or something that's what this feels like and that does not convey confidence right there right off the bat um also this feels like it's 10 years old maybe um oh it doesn't even have holes in it whoa i don't even know if that's gonna work that is bizarre wow let me just <laughs> uh huh yeah I will not be using this. Uh, I'm about to burn my house down. Bizarre. There should be holes there, 100%. All right, so you got some bizarre. Uh, yeah, all right. So let's just continue on through here. And this is the most important part of the whole thing. All right, interesting. Okay, so it, it, it it's, basically just a slightly large uh, Bluetooth speaker. Um, it's got some grippy sides over here, but they're not actually like grippy. They're not gonna like stop it from falling off of something. And they don't feel like they're grippy, like they're gonna take a good hit and keep on working. Um, it kind of feels like just really cheap rubber. Um, so that's interesting. All right, that looks like it might be an LED indicator there. Okay, I almost thought this was gonna flip open and then flip back. I was gonna say, oh, that's kind of cool. But no, it just kind of turns to its side. Ooh, there's a micro SD card slot and then the USB. That's kind of cool. Um, it sort of feels like it's waterproof here, but not 100%. Um, up the top, you got the power button. Let's see if it has any juice. Hey. Hey, it's juicing. All right. Okay, so that says 68 for me, but obviously for this camera, it's not gonna pick that up. Okay, so here is the mic. Please insert the external mic. Ah, interesting, there's the mic. That's the play, pause, power. So that's a triple threat right there. There's the skip. Here is the- Bluetooth is waiting for a connection. Cool. UHF mode. Oh, wow. Bluetooth is waiting for a connection. Okay, so Bluetooth. UHF mode. And UHF mode, I don't know what that means. All right, that still says 68 right there. Um, over here, this looks like where the microphone goes in. Very interesting how they're uh, super paranoid about water getting into this thing, yet when you open it and you go to plug in, your headphone you're now exposing it so it will get wet and be a problem so that's funny that they're they're covering it up but when you need to put an a um U a usb in there <laughs> it's weird all right okay let's see here's the clip they were talking about that's interesting a little bit more about the voice amplifier 
Okay, so coming up, we're going to test this thing and see if it actually sounds good and maybe compare it to another Bluetooth speaker to see if this is just a normal Bluetooth speaker that they're trying to push as a voice speaker. I don't know. I, I'm interested also to know what 68 means, if that's battery life. Um, of course, I'll find all of that out more. And... Um, you know, also, is this just an older speaker that they've repurposed as a voice speaker um, and called it a called it a new product? Because the fact that it has a really weird power cable or wall ward, I should say, and a weird um, old USB micro USB uh, power. Yeah, that's very strange. Oh, now it says 88. Did I do something? <laughs> All right, let's jump into it. Okay, I almost forgot, this company actually contacted me personally and they said, hey, we have a voice amplifier we want you to review. We liked your past reviews on other products, so we're gonna send you out a free, no money paid, no money given. This is non-biased review. Everything is above board <laughs> and whatnot. I forgot to mention that. So, they did send me this. I will be doing a honest, truthful review with no payment. I just get to keep this funny voice amplifier. All right, back to the video. <laughs> hey, what's up guys? I want to talk about a sponsor that I have for this channel, Don Pablo Coffee. Yes, people, Don Pablo makes an amazing variety of coffee. I actually went down to Miami, Florida and modeled for his bourbon infused coffee. Yes, people, they have bourbon infused coffee. This is coffee for the people who don't even like to drink coffee. This is coffee for people who love to drink coffee but are bored of the normal coffees. They have single serve bourbon infused coffee. They have whole bean bourbon infused coffee, not to mention all the other varieties they have. They are a small batch coffee roaster. Now you're probably thinking, what does that mean? What does it mean? I'm going to tell you, a small batch means you're going to get a fresher bean. Yes, people, everything they roast is roasted smaller, which means you're getting a fresher batch. All the other companies roast in ginormous roasting contraptions, and that means you're getting it less of a fresh batch. So click the link down below, go buy some amazing coffee, and let's get back to the video. <laughs> All right, let's talk about this bad boy right quick. So I've been using this for long enough that I'm pretty sure I have a full comprehensive review for you guys. So I would say that this thing is average quality. It's not gonna blow you away by any means, but if this is something you need, if you need to amplify your voice, definitely buy this one, but know that there's probably better ones out there. I'm gonna give this thing a solid four stars. I'm gonna say that it just, this headset could be improved in so, so many different ways. I felt like it was very uncomfortable on my head, and with my giant beard, I felt like it just wasn't functioning right. Uh, the microphone is a directional microphone, so you literally have to be talking straight into the barrel of it. Otherwise, it does not seem to pick up your voice um, as well as I would have liked. So I'm gonna give the headset a three and a half star rating. I'm gonna give the overall rating a four star rating, but this needs to be improved tremendously. Um, I love the fact that you can play music through this and still talk so you can do some kind of karaoke thing which is really fun the buttons i wish it was a single press for power on and a single press for power off it's not you have to hold it down it's old school it's janky i wish it was better um i couldn't really figure out the volume on here 
and it wasn't it it, it did increase my voice um uh, i think this is more of a plus and minus for your actual voice being picked up like how intense it is i don't think it's actually a volume um but there is no noticeable volume right on here which is kind of annoying the straps are good they're very cheap and very simple um, it does its job um, the clip for the belt works perfectly as you would want it to so if you're looking to amplify your voice and you're trying to um, not spend so 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 much money definitely think about buying this thing it's going to take a hit if you drop it you're not going to be super bummed out if it does actually break because it's not so so expensive so all in all i would say this thing is a good buy if you have kids maybe this could be really cool uh, my toddler obviously is too little to use this he'll just he would have just ended up ripping this thing off and running around with it because that's what he does best um, so if you have kids maybe over the age of five that would be kind of cool you're just going to make sure they don't get the microphone and the amplifier together because it makes a very loud noise so it's a very very nice portable amplifier it does its job if you're looking at this right now and you're going should i buy this one or should i buy the other one i would recommend buying this one because it does its job and i can't say that for yeah so um yeah that's it buy it it, it works All right, there you go. That's the Windbridge voice amplifier. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, definitely click to clack that like button. If you want to join the At Home with Lucas family and you want to be a part of this crew, hit that subscribe button. Every time I get a subscriber, I get a boost to make more and more videos. And it's because of you guys, I surpassed 2K. Yes, people, on my way to 3K, but I need your help. Yes, you right there. Tell your friends, tell your family. This guy's on YouTube. They should go subscribe and watch my channel. But as always, I thank you for watching each and every one of my videos, and I will catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.